<laughs> okay, go ahead. You know, they brought you in there to at the quarterback spot. What plays did you think you could you could make against that defense when you got in there? Oh, well, you know, we were really – they bring me in, we, we do a lot of running. So we, we planned to run a lot of read and a lot of counter with me just to see what was going to go on, but we can still throw the ball. So we kind of – we just tried to figure out what would work best against their defense. Tell us about that last drive. Oh, man. We knew we had to get the stop, and then we got the punt back. And as soon as we got the pump back, we knew we, we knew we had time. We had about four minutes to go. We knew we had done two-minute drills. We do two-minute drills every single day during practice. And we knew that we had time. We knew that we could do it. We had confidence that we could do it. So we just kept going and kept going. And we, we, we were um, making small bits, small bits, small bits. And we eventually just got one play where we, where we could pop it off and score. What does this mean to you to win the state title? Oh, this is, this is crazy. There have been so many people that told us that we'd never, we'd never do anything. We're too young. We have too many sophomores playing. But it's just... It just feels so good. We do it with all my friends, all my brothers. We're not, we're not friends. We're all brothers here. It's amazing. It's amazing. You lost to Cokeville, 18 or 19 to nothing to start the season. How far have you come since opening day? You know that really, that loss really fired us up. We knew that that kind of was a wake up call for us, that to show us that we, you know we got to keep working, we got to go. And as soon as that happened, we knew that we had to keep getting better and better every week, day by day, week by week, practice by practice. Oh my gosh, that was the best game I've ever played. That was amazing. Last drive of the game, any panic in you guys at all? Oh, heck no. That We had no panic. We knew we could drive it down and score. That's what we needed to do. We knew we had it. And we, was, we worked as hard as we could on that drive. How good did your team play under pressure tonight? We played very well under our pressure. We I didn't feel any pressure. We knew we could go down and score that final drive before the time ran out, and we did it. What does this mean to you? This is my state title. This means a lot. This was... This was the best season I've ever played. This is my final, my final season of high school football, and this was the best. I couldn't ask for a better way to end it. How much improvement did you make from the first game of the season to now? Oh, we made it. We made a ton of improvement. After losing to Cokeville, we started to get stuff on track, and we started to figure stuff out. And we we have improved every single game. Even la even this last week coming up to this game, we improved. What was going through your mind on that last drive? Uh, I'm gonna be honest with you, man. I thought I thought we had a better than a you know 85% chance to go in and score because our kids. I mean, I think everybody picked up on it, but man, we got that momentum going, and then we had kids Kimball um, throwing the ball. Our offensive line protection was absolutely amazing. Braden making catches, Jason doing what Jason does, man. We've been saying that all year long, so it's pretty phenomenal. What's going through your head as he catches that ball in the end zone? Uh, state championship. Actually, our state championship as he caught it, and then I looked up and I was like, dude, man, we got seven seconds to go. So, um, you know, and our kids just, I mean, I don't. I'm speechless. It was, it's amazing. It's the best feeling in the world. And I have the best job in the world, being in Mountain View, living in Mountain View, Wyoming. Coach, you get, were shut out on opening day by Cokeville. How far did the team come from oh, then to now? You know, that's, that's a great question. And honestly, is what we've done because, like, I mean, you know, our seniors that we have are amazing football players, and our juniors are also. But we started, on defense, we started five sophomores. So we knew our entire focus was going to get better week by week. And, and honestly, you know, there were things that happened in the Cokeville game. You know, Cokeville beat us. And, they beat us and we learned from that and we moved on and then the next Friday we were better. And we have stayed, it's been amazing, but we've steadily gotten better um, week by week.